Welcome. Thank you for taking the time to get acquainted with our portable EDM machines. Our machines easily processes on workpieces of any size, and are especially suitable for large workpieces, which are difficult to process on large EDMs. Due to high efficiency processing, they are especially good at removing large tabs and screws, as well as marking. We've been awarded seven patents for our innovative design. Our CE and ISO certifications attest to the high quality of our products. Hitherto, they've been exported to more than 20 countries, such as the USA, Europe, Australia, India, and Korea. Our products quality and services are widely recognized globally. Here is the machining process of EDM. First, point servo adjusting knob to 12 o'clock. Fix the workpiece before processing. Fix the magnetic base on a suitable place of the workpiece. Adjust the bracket by bubble level to make sure the electrode straight at the central part of the tap. Fix the work head by tightening the nut. Then attach the moving head of the outlet pump on a suitable location of the workpiece and adjust the outlet pump to aim at the machining point. Here is the boot order. First, open the power switch on the back of power box. Open the button on pump have frequency, stabber, and servo one by one. Press down button to let on corresponding indicator. Then the spindle would turn down. If you found that the spindle doesn't turn down, please press the reset button to make the work head get back to its work state. Here, I will introduce you the usage of reset button on this portable EDM. Let's introduce you the work head first, as there are upper limit and the lower limit for spindle travel. The spindle will go back automatically when it gets to the upper or lower limit. This sighting avoid the spindle being stuck. In such cases, the reset button could get work head back to work from its automatically returning mode. Now, we would like to do some demonstrations. Once bando reaches the lower limit, it would go back. At that time, the power box would allow to remind the operator and make no react to servo adjustment knob anymore which means that any operation to the down button could not pull the spindle down. Then you can press reset button for 3 seconds to stop the alarm and get the work head back to work. And the servo adjusting knob could control the spindle again. Then you can control the spindle by operating up and down button. Selection of stepper. One processing with electrodes of 6 to 18 mm in diameter, please open stepper button, then its indicator would be lighted up. The machine is into the high power mode. Turn current adjusting knob and the current can be regulated. One processing with electrodes of 2 to 5 mm in diameter. Please close stepper button. The machine is into the low power mode and the current could not be regulated. One electrode contacts the workpiece 
it would begin to discharge. At this moment, the two lifting indicator would flash alternately, and the work had start processing. At the beginning of processing, the amateur pointer would swing, which means that the current is unstable. Just slightly regulate the servo adjusting knob to control its discharge gap, and regulate the current through current adjusting knob. After the adjustment, the current is stable and work head processes efficiently. When the hole below begins to discharge and the processing becomes unstable, it proves that the tap has been punched through. Then you should keep it processing for another 2 to 3 minutes to make sure that the type is thoroughly punched. After processing, please lift the work head and turn off the power box. Press button for high frequency, stabber. The corresponding indicators would let off and the high frequency is closed. The spindle would turn up automatically. Wait until the electrode left the workpiece and press button for servo. Then press pump button to let off corresponding indicator. At last, turn off power switch. Finally, take down the workpiece. You can see that the central part of the type has already been punched through and turned into three pieces. You can use some suitable tool to take out broken tap. These are broken pieces of removing tap. However, the thread of workpiece is not damaged at all.